Welcome to my world. my channel. We are in my kitchen. We're going to make a very easy Dollar Tree dinner today. We're going to do a jambalaya. I am so excited for this. It is going to be four ingredients and it will be four or more. Perfect for the stove top in your Dutch oven. I'm going to turn the camera around and show you what you need. need is a can of diced tomatoes, a beef sausage, I have some bell pepper strips and a seasoning blend, which is celery, onion, and bell pepper, because it does call for onion. This is a mix. It does not have the rice included. And I have their jasmine rice, which is easy to do. Just pop it in the microwave. I'm going to prep the sausage here. Sometimes they make it difficult to get them out. I'm going to give them a quick rinse. Then you're going to cut them into silver dollar pieces about a half inch thick. If you have a larger family or has a family that likes a lot of meat, use two of these drum roll sausages. They're usually always available in the refrigerated section at the Dollar Tree if you have one. That is a train you hear in the background. Not a lot of birds today. The weather has been really iffy. Occasional robin and blue jay. Cutting it, you need two. For this video, all the vegetables are pre-cut. Now we're going to add salt. A couple of dashes. And then we're going to add some cooking oil. Two to three times around. Now the salt's going to prevent everything from spattering up in your face. Once we get over the stove top, I will spray a little bit of butter spray too. Drop in the meat. Now we're going to add in the rice mix. Go ahead and dump it on in. Now we're going to add in the vegetables. When I have an opened bag of vegetables, because I don't use an entire bag all the time, I keep them in a Ziploc bag so they don't spill out all over the place. About a quarter of a cup. And I'm going to use about a quarter of a cup of this bag. It's going to go in the Ziploc bag back in about a quarter of a cup of the seasoning blend. That is bell pepper, celery, and onion. I'm going to get my microwave rice. We're going to get this going with about a quarter cup of water. Bring it to a slow boil and then add the rice in. I'm going to cook the rice in the microwave first to make it. Seconds in the microwave for the rice and let it stand. I'm going to take the Dutch oven to the stove top. Keep in mind the jambalaya is a mix, does not have rice with it. You have a cup of rice, I'm going to add in an entire 8 ounce package. Your front left burner on, or whichever burner you like to cook with most, to almost high. Make sure it's heating up. Add in the water. And you're going to mix everything. The 
So this is still a four ingredient dinner because there was almost no peppers left in that bag. I'm gonna take the rice out of the microwave. Let it stand for a minute before we add it into the dish. Let these spices get going with the meat in here. You can hear it sizzling. Turn your heat down to medium heat. Add your black pepper. I do have the black pepper and garlic combo still. I just stocked up on three of them. I didn't add in a, the entire can of diced tomatoes with its juices. They carry hunts at the Dollar Tree. You're going to mix it well. This is a real easy dinner to throw together in minutes and it won't heat up your kitchen. I can go ahead and open up the rice and add it in. I love the jasmine rice from the Dollar Tree. I love the jasmine rice from the Dollar Tree. We use it all the time. Now go ahead and mix in the rice with the jambalaya mix, the meat, and the diced tomatoes. You're going to let it cook for about 10 to 15 minutes. The rice is already pre-cooked. Beef sausages are always pre-cooked. They're a beef pork mix. Not bad from the Dollar Tree when money's tight. This is going to feed a lot of people. And you can get our Texas Toast cornbread mix and that makes a ton of cornbread. You can split them up into two different meals and bake a little at a time. Do 12 one day and 12 another time or make them all and freeze some to serve with this. That would be awesome. Or the Texas garlic toast that they have available. That too would be perfect. Do them in the air fryer so you do not heat up your kitchen. This smells incredible. A few savvy regular watchers, Louis Johnson, Louis Chokard, Stuff he needs. If you didn't notice that the packages were empty when I told you what you needed for to make this jambalaya, I have got the diced tomato and it says mix on the box, so be very diligent when you're reading it so you don't expect rice to be in it. And always add on to feed your family. Or I would use two sausages. Yeah, a Dollar Tree Jambalaya with their Dollar Tree mix and their microwave jasmine rice and sausage, beef, and pork by John Morrell. Thrown together in minutes in your Dutch oven. Feast is done. I'm going to remove it from the heat show some on the plate so you can see what it looks like and we're going to give it a try it smells incredible i can't wait and serve some on plates so you can see what it looks like there's a lot of food here that looks incredible it looks like on the plate it looks absolutely delicious look at that That's a lot of food. Let's go ahead and try it. I love using the rice from the microwave because my rice comes out perfect. It could be hot. Mm. If you notice, I didn't add any garlic. I didn't need it. It is delicious video thank you so much for hanging out with me and watching me all the way to the end making this delicious a dollar tree dinner to stretch that dollar further give you more bang for your buck there's all kinds of videos available on youtube that you could even eat for 15 dollars a week but with their dollar 25 um, product raise that is a challenge think about trying the jambalaya it is incredible and it feeds four with leftovers as you saw in the dutch oven when we get to 1500 we're going to issue out two $10 Dollar Tree gift cards. When we get five more people, we're going to issue out one five items prize pack from the Dollar Tree valued at $625. You must be a U.S. citizen and subscribe. If you're new, you must comment. Let me know that you're new in order to be qualified for my drawings. If you won in the past 60 days, you have to wait out six days. 
if your name has been called, if you don't answer me within two days, you'll be disqualified, a new name will be chosen. If it's something extreme, email me, countryboots1268yahoo.com. That is in my description box, every one of them, for your information. Let me know what's going on. Sometimes we've still sent out the gift card depending on the circumstances. Thank you for watching.